Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world just now. This is the Unstoppable Show and I am Jennifer Hardy. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I am joined today by the beautiful Cesar Uzunyan. Um, and Cesar lives in Scotland and she is an incredible female entrepreneur, thought leader and influencer. And we are going to pass you over to Cesar right now. Cesar, welcome, welcome. How are you? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for having me on the show. I'm you're really so good. Um, you're, you're so welcome. It's amazing to have you. Cesar, I am not going to speak too much about the epicness of you. I am going to let you tell everyone what is it that you do and a little bit of the kind of backstory of how you got involved in what you do now. Okay. Um, well, I'm an EAM mentor, which an EAM stands for Energy Alignment Method. And I'm also a fitness instructor. So, um, and I've combined these things to uh, help women be, feel more empowered and confident. Um, so a bit about my background. Um, well, <laughs> it's a long story, but kind of get it short. I did an engineering degree at uni, uh, struggled to find work. Um, and I got to a point where um, I was quite low and I, Reevaluated my life and went what is it I actually want to do yeah um, which then led me into doing an acting course because that's what I always wanted to do awesome. which then led me into fitness <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, in fitness you see a lot of women's insecurities um, or like their lack of confidence in them or their bodies yeah and then, and then I discovered EAM um, I don't really know how it just came into my life uh, and I did the course and then I trained to be a mentor because uh, the results are just amazing. Oh, fantastic. So with the EAM, what, what is it? Um, energy and alignment. Yeah. Yeah. So what kind of things, is it like a method that you can, that, that you can adapt into or adopt into your everyday life or is it a kind of course or how does it work? Um, so yeah, it is a method. So it's an energy psychology tool, um, awesome. which um, basically bridges the gap between Eastern spiritual principles, therapeutic methods, uh, energy, modern uh, research into like quantum physics, neuroscience, uh, neurocardiology, and things. Um, so it's a speedy, like effective five-step process for raising your energy, aligning your heart and your mind, and basically keeping in flow. Um, yeah, so, which as entrepreneurs, we all need flow. Definitely. <laughs> we all um, need um, well, what's great about EAM is once you've got the basic understanding, you can always, you can do it, you can do it to yourself. So you don't need anyone else necessarily. Um, although another person can pick out things you can't, but it's yeah. just an amazing tool that is so quick and effective to really find what's, I don't know what resistances you have, what's blocking your way. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Excellent. And then of course, combined with the, with the fitness side of things as well, that's just a beautiful combination, isn't it? Because if yeah. you're fit and your body is strong and healthy, then you can be so much more in flow and so much more focused on your goals or your dreams or your desires. Uh, yeah, absolutely. If your body's not healthy or it's not fit, then it's not going to be, serving you the best way you can yeah, um, so i definitely i've made a lot of changes coming into this new year um and you know what it's like because we both we're both female entrepreneurs we're, we're both there uh, work very very hard at what we do it's very easy to get sidetracked and to not look after your body as well as you should so the changes yeah. i've made this year um are to my eating plans and um, to my fitness but um, also to the time that I take away from things like social media. Mm. I mean, it's funny, because that is what I do. Like, I'm the digital marketing strategist. I'm always on social media, but I've, I've managed now to, to be in a space where I can um, kind of pre-record things, uh, to, to put things in place so that it just runs automatically. And I think that is so important, you know, to be away from the screens. Um, yeah. As much time as you possibly can be. Yeah, I totally agree. Like being fit and healthy isn't just about eating well or doing enough exercise. It's yeah. actually about having that downtime. Um, yeah. you know, social media and like our phones are so 
addictive. Like you yeah. want to, you know, you post something, you want to quickly check, oh, who's liked it, who's commented. Yeah. But actually it's so important to take that time out or, you know, rest and it affects our sleep and everything. Yeah, definitely. I've also just ordered another little mobile phone, like almost old school. Uh-huh. And what you can do on it is, is text and call. Um, and what I'm going to do is over the weekends and at a certain time every evening, my phone goes away, like my work phone goes away and I'll, I'll, if I'm going out for dinner or whatever, I'll take out this little phone just in case, you know, the, the kids are trying to get in touch with me or something like that. Yeah. No social media on it at all. And listen, that is going to be like a detox for me because I do mm. spend so much time, you know, preparing things to put out into the world and to be on social media. So that's, that is, that's going to be huge. And I'm actually a little bit nervous about it. Can you imagine your first night out after so long of being on social media, not having anything to look at? It's, exactly. <laughs> it's going to be so strange, but I'm, I am excited. And another thing I've done is, is just stop drinking alcohol as well. Oh, that's good. Nice. Yeah, so completely um, all together. And I have noticed a massive difference to my productivity levels. I mean, I wasn't like a huge drinker, but I did enjoy a glass of wine or two um, Mm -hmm. in the evenings with my dinner and stuff like that. And I've I've noticed just by not having that, a huge, huge difference um, to what I get done and what I can achieve within the following day. And how much Mm -hmm. I'm gonna continue to work. Like I've been working sometimes to 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock at night, and not even realizing that I'm doing it. I love what I do anyway. But, you know, I'm just like, woo, I'm on fire. I'm just going to keep on going. Um, yeah. Obviously, my kids are in bed and I've had my time with them. But, but yeah, it's, it's an exciting kind of change. But I've changed a lot. Mm. Uh, you don't have to, by the way, if you're listening out there, do not do that all at the same time. <laughs> you have to do it stages. Yeah, wean yourself off of different things at different stages. Um, so I was going to ask, Cesar, what is your favourite part of doing what you do now and working with women in this way? Um, I'd say my favorite part is seeing the change uh, in the the people I work with Um, so like the fitness you see their body changing you see them becoming stronger more flexible and more confident to do harder exercises um, which is really great to see because then you know you're doing something you're making a difference Um, and with the EAM it's just it's amazing to see how in such a short space of time so much can happen so much can change for the better yeah Um, and yeah that's been really amazing because then you can see how the person's changing and they're kind of stepping into their power and you know owning their life and what they want to do so that's that's been really amazing and going in their their future as well exactly yeah it must be really exciting and i was going to ask as well it says what has your biggest challenges been because obviously we know that you do this and this is incredible but obviously you've had to start that business from scratch and and build it and adapt and change it and then go with the flow and and bring a lot of it online because i mean this is the space that everything's happening at the moment is a really fired up digital uh, online space and magic can happen here um, so, so how have you found it what's your challenges been um <laughs> there's been a lot of challenges in the last year <laughs> yes. um so uh well i was in london before and i built up the fitness side to quite a quite a busy business and you know in the year i increased it by about five times so you know it was doing really well but then when i moved to glasgow um it meant i had to start from scratch so that's been quite challenging just because i don't really know glasgow so having to find the places to teach and meeting clients and getting out there um and then also with the mentoring that's a new thing i started last year so the challenge was to do all my coaching hours and then again get clients in get it out there get myself out there be visible um yeah and i guess I guess the other challenge is being more, um, I guess being more visible online because it can feel, I'm quite a private person, so it feels quite revealing, but actually it's been really well received. So (laughs) that's been really interesting. Yeah, you were saying you're quite a private person. Yes. Um, I was saying I'm quite a private person. So to be visible online almost feels like, revealing a part of yourself um yeah definitely it is it's about that and and the when i'm obviously working with clients um 
who are going through a period of feeling a little bit like I don't really want to divulge um, you know, parts of my story. But actually, that is what makes you connect to other women. It's what makes them be attracted to you and to want to work with you is, is your story, you know, and how transparent you are. And, and if you can embrace all the things that have happened that you necessarily don't want to share at the beginning, you're only going to become um, much more attractive to your target audience. That's okay. definitely something that I that I have realised. And you know, I'm the same as you. I'm actually a really private person as well, um, and I still sometimes feel quite nervous about um, giving over another part of me, my story. My story is huge, and I've I've never divulged the whole thing, but I will absolutely um, in in pieces. And it's yeah. just you feel confident and comfortable with, isn't it, as you go through. You, I, you definitely get more confident and more comfortable as your community grows, I think. Have you yeah. found that as well? Yeah, I, yeah, I agree. Um, because you attract the people who get you. Um, yeah, exactly. Or who are going through similar things. Um, yeah. And, you know, mostly it's well received uh, and people are supportive and you know, they're like, yeah, I get that. I've been through that. <laughs> so, exactly. Exactly. Yeah. And then they're like, do you know what, instead of working with someone else that maybe hasn't been as transparent or, or hasn't embraced the, the kind of big um, hurdles, yeah. I, I'm, I'm going to work with this person because they get me, they know how I might be feeling and the kind of things I might be up against. Um, and that's exciting. It's, you, you do attract, what is it they say, your vibe attracts your tribe yeah <laughs> oh true isn't it it really really yeah. is so what is your goal for 2018 my goal for 2018 is um to launch my uh, online program which is uh called unleash your wonder woman awesome. um, and it's all about women um becoming confident in their bodies uh you know, discovering what's important to them, stepping to their power and living the life they want. Awesome. Um, so that's goal number one. <laughs> I've got a retreat coming up in March. we are finally like the dates. Yeah. Um, so that's up, uh, just overlooking Loch Ness. So it's really nice location. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, um, with a nutritionist. So that's going to be combined fitness and nutrition and lots of other things to come up, but I don't know yet. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. That's, that is fantastic. So tell me, you have got a six months program yes. and is this for, can, so can any woman um, apply to be part of that, that program? Yeah. Yes. Any woman who feels she would benefit from it can apply for it. Um, fantastic. Amazing. Yeah. And what kind of things are involved in that six months? So six months, is it one-to-one -one coaching or is it group coaching working with it's, you? It's group coaching um, because I think it's really, it's great to have a group and everyone supports each other. Yeah, absolutely. So there will be the Facebook community uh, group specifically for the program where they can, you know, support and talk to each other, update on the progress. Um, there will be two group um zoom calls a month where we can talk about what's happening in that month um, there'll be a workbook to work through like eam questions um, you know each month is slightly different topic ones about um, you know fitness goals confidence work relationships so it's, it's a mixture of things and there will be a, a 20 to 30 minute pilates uh, exercise video once a week just so combine everything <laughs> life overhaul really isn't it yeah six months transformation yes that's the plan <laughs> fantastic i am really really excited uh, for that so tell me as well because i know that you are of my like and you adore to give away some value and some help and some guidance and you have created an awesome freebie for our listeners haven't you yes i have Amazing. Um, you're going to be able to download that from the link below but what is it says what have you what have you created for us so it's a three-day uh challenge um so it's, it's to do with the online program so it's taking ideas so it's three days 
where they will get EAM questions to work on, um, yeah. an exercise move, and just to start finding out where what resistances they have, how EAM works for them, um, and then align to the positive on whatever they're working on. So we're looking at beliefs and emotions and you know chakras and energies to do with body confidence and fitness. Oh, fantastic. I am super, super excited to download that myself because I want to know more about it too. And I want to really get into EAM. It sounds incredible. So, says I want to say a huge big thank you for having and um, for, for coming on the show today. I would um, like to ask you one last question, and it is for our listeners listening out there today, if they had to, um, or they were thinking about changing something within their diet or within their health um, lifestyle in, in some way, what would your top tip, what would your number one thing be to them uh, listening today? What could they change? Oh, that's a hard one. <laughs> hard. I know there's so many things that you could think about. but um, I'm gonna go with make sure you get enough sleep because that's yeah. been popping up a lot lately. Yeah. and. I watched a video by a sleep doctor in America who was saying, if you're not getting enough sleep, like after 16 hours of being awake, your body starts deteriorating and it's, and it's like, like if you're driving, it's almost like driving drunk. It's like, so it's so important to get enough sleep. And I know a lot of people, you know, sacrifice sleep to do other things. So yeah. make sure you get enough sleep. <laughs> Good yeah, quality sleep. I completely agree with that though. Yeah, I, I do start to feel um, like I'm drunk <laughs> when I don't yeah. get enough sleep. Because your mind is just not working at the same capacity as what it normally is. It's, it's no. um, and then you, you go through a period of time where if you're not getting enough sleep, you're waking up in the morning even more tired than when you went to bed because your body's just so out of routine. Okay. So that's an amazing tip, definitely. So guys, if you're listening to this and it's past bedtime, <laughs> bed to bed. Go to bed and rest and rest and rest. And um, says, uh, thank you so much again. Where can we find you, by the way? Do you have a community or a group or anything like that? I have a group on Facebook. Um, oh, What's that called? It's called Fearless Warriors. Awesome. Um, and... Or they can go to my page, which is facebook.com forward slash Cesar Health Wellness. Awesome. Um, Excellent. Brilliant. Um, and then it's all linked. Excellent. Okay, brilliant. So, so excited to get into your community um, and to get to know what you do. So Cesar, thank you so much. It's been an absolute pleasure to have you on the show. Thank you so much for having me on the show. It's been amazing. Oh, amazing. Thank you so much. Uh, I want to say good morning, good afternoon, good evening to all of you guys all over the world, wherever you are. Thank you so much for tuning in. We are so grateful to always have you listening and to hopefully be gaining some inspiration and motivation from our incredible women that we speak to uh, each and every day. Uh, if you would like to get to know anything about myself or Unstoppable, or of course apply to be on this podcast show, then you can click the links below and they will all be there. Have an incredible day or evening wherever you are and we will chat soon. Peace out everyone. Take care.